here's the diff- changes that we made. Since we had to live in dirt for a year and a half, we stared at the pool for a year and a half. We decided that we wanted a spa and not just any spa, but we decided to build an eight foot by 15 foot long waterfall that dumps into a trough that then waterfalls into a little oasis that runs around a free floating spa. And then that, that little waterway dumps into the pool. Uh, did we have a designer build that? Oh, yes, we did. Did we think that up ourselves? No, no, not at all. I'm a pretty good designer, but not at that level. Uh, so we had a professional design that up. It's gorgeous. We absolutely love it. Uh, that gets water in you know, two days, maybe three days. So we're excited to see that come to fruition. Why we were also staring at the house for a year and a half, we ended up putting in the four-car garage white stucco and black windows. Now, when you have a 1964 house that's tan with old, old aluminum windows, you want to update it to match the cool new garage that you just built. So on a spur of the moment last month, we actually pulled the trigger on all new stucco and pulled all the sign off of our house and went to go put in all brand new uh, vinyl black windows and redo the stucco. Thank goodness we did that to make everything match me cohesive because we pull all the siding off. Apparently in 1964, they must have been allergic to insulation because we have none, not one, not one piece of insulation. So we got R19 throughout the whole entire house, got that all set up, put all the real siding on on the stucco. I will tell you the last two days has been 90, 92 degrees. Our house is still a consistent 75 degrees inside and the air conditioning is not even on. So unbelievable what insulation can do for you. I mean, I was paying $600 a month just in the SDG need build to keep the AC at a somewhat of a decent level of 78, 79 degrees, 75 without the AC on. So it's unbelievable what insulation does. So we got the house stuccoed, we got the waterfall feature figured out. We ended up building, or, or it's still building, I should say, it's not complete yet, full kitchen outdoor patio set. Um, so we have a full outdoor eating area and sitting area. And then uh, something on my bucket list. 